solid wooden candle stand. Nothing useful here. A small fence is protecting something. It looks like some kind of mechanical piece. These candles look special. Maybe I can try to light. Maybe I can try to lit them all. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Winding mechanism. The first time I played, I thought pole was going to pop up there. That would have been cool. Now we go... Down to the fun house. And our Welcome. last weapon... Not enough to no, wait. Uh, long bow rifle, vertical double barrel rifle, loaded with, with Hans arms that has power to pierce through enemies two single shots. I like this one better than, like, even though that only holds two, I like it better than the, um, the revolver, the Hans revolver. Like, it's, it's better, um, it's more damage, and the reload is less, even though, the reload is less, uh, is, is shorter, even though, you know. Um, what was I doing? Oh, I want to wear this dress. I'm, um... I'll wear it for the final boss. done that better.
No, no, no. I, I, just, I thought I saw something there. Go, go away! Stop! Chemical type C, and that's it. Just want to check something. Are there any other monsters that spawn in these rooms? have very many med kits at all. Where did they all go? So the answer is no. No more enemies spawn here. Just in uh, places where you would have uh, needed to go. 
no secret enemies, as far as I can tell. No secret enemies that can grant you more tooth wheels. Not that we can really unlock anything uh, that will carry over. Well, we've unlocked everything that we need uh, that will carry over into our new game plus. Um. Oh, the only thing I didn't show you was the uh, Al Al Alvarez uh, reward because he's he's a boss even though we fought him in a weird mini game shooter thing. He's still a boss. So, let me make the bomb and then I'll save and show you. And then we will do the final boss. This was the wrong way. Oh, okay, it was the wrong way, but I can go this way. Oh, we need to make the bomb. Winding mechanism. Chemical A. And chemical C. The bomb. Yeah. Lord Albertus. The heavy machine gun is an anti-infantry weapon used in times of war. Can't sprint, can't bring a second weapon ammo 70 times Louis bullet. Whoa. And a cherub puppet minion shoots nearby enemies for 10 minutes. That's a lot. That's all we need. Thank you. Thank you. All right.
love this so much. You instantly know something's wrong. Probably should have expected this. No, damn it. <laughs> no, <laughs> we're off to a great start. Don't run too far away from him because then um, he'll jump you. By the way, his health is determined by uh, how much uh, we bought from Paul earlier. I uh, would not recommend um, like limiting the amount of stuff you buy, though. It's honestly pretty marginal, um, or maybe not marginal, but uh, it's better to just buy the stuff you need and, and deal with his health because. Um, you should have uh, enough weapons and ammo to deal with them at this point. All right, so that was Alisa by Casper Crows uh, with music by Arisa. 
And, uh, I hope you enjoyed uh, it as much as I did. I really like this game. As I mentioned before, uh, it has a lot of flaws, but the flaws are not, like, game-ruining, in my opinion. It's, um... Uh, it, it, it's kind of like tuning issues, like, like, enemies should, uh, do less damage in a way that makes it easier, and I, I, I'm, I like the way I played here, like, that's a hard mode or normal mode, depending on how you see it, but I think there should be an easy mode implemented, uh, for newer players, or, um, maybe more hidden items, so there's less of a finite, um, amount of, uh, med kits, stuff like that. Um, it just, it, it needs to be made easier for, uh, first time players because I, I know a lot of people who were frustrated and like could not finish this game, at least not the first time they played, um, only when they went through and they knew like where the enemies were, where the med kits, blah, 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 all that. Uh, and this, these are all the Kickstarters who, uh, helped make this game happen. Uh, I am not on here because <laughs> I would have funded this Kickstarter if I knew about it prior to the game's uh, release, but I only found out about this game a little before the beta version uh, was released. Um, these are some interesting names. Uh, much, much, much more uh, successful Kickstarter than the horrible Night Cry game, and. Uh, Trust me, it's day is coming, but I don't want to play it right now. Um, <laughs> don't want to have to deal with that shit. Guest, guest three nine four zero zero eight three three one. This this couldn't have happened without you. Um, I uh, uh, I uh, the um aesthetic and the music of this game, the graphics are absolutely one hundred percent on point. I uh I I could not hope for, like, a more, um, beautiful looking, but, like, in the, uh, in the style that it wanted, the Resident Evil style that it wanted, it is so meticulously designed, there is so much love put into this game, um, I would really like a sequel, and as I, as I said before, um, I think that there are some tuning issues, uh, that need fixing, but, like, I want the developer to fix that, and maybe add a few more dresses, and then, like, just start working on a sequel. Um, and there, there's an FMV after this, uh, by the way. That wasn't just the ending. Uh, that, that wasn't the entire ending. There's an FMV. And I could fast forward through this if I want, wanted to. Um, but right now, I just have some other stuff to say. I, I love the voice acting. It's hilariously bad. It's perfect. Um... Just the camera angles are, are so good. The annoying parts of this game are, like, annoying in, in a very good way, I think. Um, I'm not making much sense. There are many Pauls. Many Pauls. Um, just, uh... Oh, and more memos. We need more memos. <laughs> Even if it's just useless stuff, uh, like, Today I woke up and drank some coffee, and then I went to my new mining job. Hmm, this is really interesting. Why are they paying us so much? So many Stevens. Thank you, Steven, Steven, and Steven, and Steven. Uh, oh yeah. And, uh, right after this, we are going to play a new game plus and we are going to get ending C so we are going to get all the modifications and uh, that that's how you get ending C and we are going to uh, betray Elise I guess you could say
ti din sualo mai kyurdan. The truth about the blueprints find out in the sequel, I guess. I mean, I have a pretty good idea of what it is, but...